click on the subscribe button, and press the bell icon, to never miss any updates. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Alhamdulillah. Assalamu ala rasulillah ma ba'd. Brothers and sisters, uh, you know, when uh, I was listening to the hadith about caring for each other as your brother, and the hadith about when you make dua for your brothers in absence, angels make dua for you. In other words, angels say, well, Allah, before it grants to the other brother, let this dua be granted for this person who made the dua. So those of us are here, uh, Dr. Masari is friends of many of you, all of you probably here. I don't know if anybody else invited us, except Brother Kabir I know, and Imam Sahib I know, of course, And but Dr. Masari invited you, he's most of our personal friends, especially yours. And, uh, you know, all of us I can see that we are frequently at most of the fundraising, whether it's in Queens, Brooklyn, name it, everywhere you go. So, so you are used to listening to all the verses from the Quran, the Ahadith, and the virtues of giving. And sometimes when you sit here and think, that you can, if you look around the table, you're, uh, in the room, you'll see the same faces pretty much almost everywhere. That's a statement that all of us should think, a situation that all of us should think. It is, must be the blessing of Allah that these brothers are able to do it over and over and over and over. That goes to show that Allah's promise is truth. Allah said, when you give, Allah increases your wealth. If it hadn't been that the truth of the hadith, that these brothers that and sisters that you see everywhere, they would not be, would not have been able to, you know, would not be able to do this donation over and over. And I know most of them, alhamdulillah, they're in their life. If you look at their uh, the wealth, is increasing. Allah is one of blessing them more and more and more. So that is something that we all need to be convinced. That as long as we are sincere, that is, has to be a very important point. As long as we are sincere in whatever we do, whether we give $100 or $100,000, it doesn't matter. The key thing is we have to be sincere. Allah's promise will come through. We have to have that faith. So with that, I'm sure all of you, we all know why we are here. And inshallah, this community, I think they're doing, trying to do, build the masjid. And I, I know the masjid, we know the masjid, especially for a long time, there was a, another brother, uh, I forgot his name, a Guyanese brother who was the president. Uh, Jafar. Jafar. Jafar, yes. He was the first president, I believe, right? Brother Kabir, and I actually, I remember when we actually bought the, they bought the place, we we're very much involved since then. Alhamdulillah, some communities have it easier, Allah bless them, and it's easier for them to raise within the community they're able to do. Some communities, they have to go out and depend. And, send, and this is an opportunity for all of us to participate. And I hope and pray that inshallah we'll do this. Just before I leave, I just one hadith. I often remind myself and everybody else. And we know that when angels make dua, all the duas are accepted. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, whether you will get the reward now or later, you will get your dua will be accepted. Inshallah, Allah will reward you for the dua, your dua will be accepted. But we know for when angels make dua, you will see the result right away. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is a surah in, 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 in Muslim, Sahih Muslim, the Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, not a day, a day the sun rises on earth, two angels will come. One will make dua through Allah, bless or increase the wealth of the person who donates. And as a Muslim, we must have that conviction, that faith, and that trust this dua is accepted. Again, let me repeat, the angels come, will, the hadith goes, not a single day when the sun rises on earth. Two angels, but two angels will descend upon earth and they will make dua. First one will make dua, O Allah, increase the wealth of the person who donates. Whether it's a dollar, two dollars, doesn't matter what, but donates. 
same, there's another angels make dua. Oh Allah, destroy the person who held it. The condition is if you have to have it to give. If we have it, we, that's something we all have to take it in seriously. Well, I, make, I make dua that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, first and foremost, all of us make intention that we are doing sincerely for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, for our own benefit. Masjid will benefit for sure, the community will benefit for sure, but first and foremost, it is our own benefit. We, it is cleansing our wealth, it is cleansing our, it removes a lot of calamity from us. It helps us to become closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as long as we are sincere. So, there will be I mean, uh, uh, Imam Shamsi Ali and others are here, inshallah, they will speak. So we are, I urge all of you to try to do your best, inshallah, whatever you can. I'm not sure what the project, what's the remaining of the project, I'm sure you will share with us, inshallah. And then we'll take it from there. So Zakallah khair. Again, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you, give barakah on you and reward you. Uh, uh, you know, as whatever the intention you are, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reward you for this. Zakallah khair. ITV, call of peace, save humanity.